वेलकम बैक प्रॉब्लम 2.96 सो द स्टेटमेंट इज फॉर पी इज इक्वल टू 100 किलो न्यूटन डिटरमाइन द मिनिमम प्लेट थिकनेस टी रिक्वायर्ड इफ अलाउेबल स्ट्रेस इज 125 मेगा पास्कल सो यू कैन सी दिस इज द प्लेट वेयर पी लोड इज अप्लाइड द पी इज 100 किलो न्यूटन ऑल द डायमेंशंस आर गिवन देयर इज अ होल ए एंड देयर इज अ फिलेट बी दैट इज गिवन सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वी विल राइट गिवन डेटा so in given data it is given that this load p is equal to 100 kilo newton also allowable stress is equal to 125 mega pascal your stress should not is increase 125 mega pascal so what you have to find you have to find the the minimum plate thickness t minimum मिनिमम प्लेट थिकनेस टी क्लियर सो लेट स्टार्ट विद द सोल्यूशन नाउ यू कैन सी देर आर होल ए एंड फिलिट बी सो वी विल गो वी विल फाइंड द मैक्सिमम स्ट्रेस इन ए एज वेल एज एट द फिलिट बी सो वट वी विल डू इज दैट फर्स्ट वी विल टेक एट होल सो एट होल यू कैन सी द रेडियस ऑफ दिस होल इज ट्वेंटी एम एम सो आर ए इज इक्वल टू ट्वेंटी एम एम क्लियर ऑल्सो डी ए नाउ वट इज डी ए सो डी ए इज दिस डिस्टेंस दिस प्लस दिस एंड हाउ यू विल फाइंड सो एटी एट माइनस डायमीटर ऑफ होल सो रेडियस इज ट्वेंटी मिलीमीटर सो डायमीटर विल बी फोर्टी सो डी ए इज इक्वल टू फोर्टी एट मिली मीटर नाउ we know that stress concentration factor k can be found k can be found by using two r a divided by t a now we have value 2 into r a is 20 divided by d a is this distance which is 88 uh, sorry Uh, capital D, which is the uh, weight, and this is equal to capital D A. Okay, so divide by eighty eight, so it will give you the value of zero point four double five. Now we will find K. K is equal to by using figure by using figure twenty point six twenty point. 2.60 sorry 2.60 a you can find k how we will find so remember k is equal to 0.45 clear so you can see this is uh, uh, 2r over d clear so i will show you again there is a problem so let me write it on this so k was 0. Four five. So again, you can see four five is this one. So if you project this line, so k will be two point two. You can see this is k. This value is k is equal to two point two. So again, you have to go back and you have to write k is equal to two point two zero. Now we know that maximum stress is equal to k into Sigma average, and sigma average k is equal to sigma average is p divided by area net area. Clear that is equal to sigma average maximum. So from here you will know that sigma max is equal to k into p divided by net area is equal to d a into t, d a into t because you have to take this distance. Plus this, which is small d a into thickness t. So this is so. From here you will get this thickness of plate is equal to uh, k into p divided by sigma max into d a. Now you have this t. You can put the value t k is two point two zero into. P is given as hundred kilo newton, so hundred into ten is to power three divided by allowable stress is 
125 megapascal so 125 into 10 raised to power 6 and d uh, d a d a is 48 millimeter which is in term of meter is equal to 4, 0.048 meter so from here you will get this t is equal to 36.7 let me write it clear 36.7 into 10 to the power minus 3 or t meter or t is equal to 36.7 millimeter but this thickness is calculated based on hole we have we have fill it as well we have fill it as well so we will go for fill it and we will do the same procedure so you can see that uh, for fill it d is again d capital d is 88 millimeter which is same for both you can see the maximum width of this plate is 88 millimeter and minimum d for this portion this is minimum d so small d is equal to 64 millimeter and for uh, fillet we know that we should get this d by d value as well so 88 divided by 64 which will give you 1.375 okay also radius of fillet b is also given you can see it over here this is rb is 15 millimeter so i will write it 15 millimeter now rb over small d b or width at b is or you can simply take it as d small d as well so 15 divided by small d is 64 so from here you will get this uh, ratio is equal to 0 0.32344 now you have two value one is this one and other one is this one so these two values will be uh, used in order to calculate stress concentration factor which is k i will write it stress concentration factor for fillet and we will use figure 2.60 b so let let's move toward again the same same figure and now you can see that we have uh, d capital d divided by small d which was 1.37 so one uh, sorry uh, capital D divided by small d be 1.37 so this is 1.3 graph you can see this 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 one is 1.3 graph clear so we will use this one and what will what was the value of rb over dv which 0 0.23 so this is 0 0.2 and 0 0.23 so it will be somewhere like this so when you project it it will be k will be equal to 1.7 so i will write it k is equal to 1.7 now again we know that maximum stress is equal to k into average which is p divided by here you will take minimum area because the area here is minimum one which is d into small d into t so that is equal to k into p divided by db into t and from here you will get this thickness is equal to uh, k into p divided by sigma maximum into db okay so k is 1.70 p was 
100 kilo newton so 100 into 10 is to power 3 divided by maximum stress is 125 megapascal so 125 into 10 is to power 6 pascal and db is 64 millimeter which in turn meter is equal to 0 0.0 0 0.064 meter so from here you will get this thickness is equal to 21.25 into 10 to the power minus 3 meter and this in term of meter will be equal to 21.25 millimeter and this thickness is calculated for fillet radius. Now you can see that in this problem we have calculated one thickness which comes out to be 21.25 another thickness that's come out to be 36.7 millimeter. So 36.7 millimeter is the largest. So if you use 36.7 millimeter for the fillet as well, it will be safe. But we cannot use thickness of 21.25 for whole calculation so always you have to choose the largest value so the conclusion is that larger value of thickness of plate is the minimum thickness required And this is the solution of our answer of our question number 2.96. I hope you have clear understanding about such type of problem in which there is a stress concentration as well. Thank you for watching and supporting me. Take care. Allah Hafiz.